Hey there, folks. Welcome to another edition of Gotcha Racing TV, Gotcha Racing Live. I'm your host, Joe Britt. I'm coming to you from Trackside. And this is the newest venue that uh, NASCAR put out, which is a quarter of a mile track, right? And it's called The Clash. Now, they did this last year, and it turned out very successful. So this year, we are in the bleachers, okay? And as you see over here, we got the track, okay? Bubba Wallace just passed by me and gave him a pump. But nevertheless, um, I was here the other night doing shooting for the diversity program. I didn't know they had a diversity program within NASCAR. And it's they were giving awards to uh, people of color, diversity, you know, trying to get some color in, into NASCAR, which is a good deal, actually. It's very smart um, because the only color of money is green, right? So you just gotta have to get rid of all of the complexions and all this other stuff and concentrate on the business end. And I think NASCAR is trying to do that. Uh, this is their 15th year of doing the diversity program. So this year, what I wanna show you guys, just a sampling of what they have done from the award ceremony. And I got a couple of clips here that I'm gonna show you. One is, is of a 13 year old driver, you know, that they are grooming. And uh, he's doing some, some phenomenal things. A guy, little kids from North Carolina. His mom was with him, and uh, I was excited to see a 13-year-old being groomed from NASCAR. So totally cool. They gave him an award, and they gave some. They gave 10 individuals a plaque of appreciation that particular evening. And I will show you some of it um, from time to time. You know, meaning that a clip at a time, because it's an hour. The, the whole process was an hour long. And we'll probably end up putting that on our uh, Amazon TV and our Ruko TV, the whole hour program, which is pretty cool. So I take my hat off to NASCAR for doing what they're doing and reaching out to the urbanites and getting them involved. Not just the black folks, but the brown and all urbanites within the city, you know, which have no clue of how NASCAR functions. I tell you, in Fontana, if you're ever going to race in Fontana, it's a, it's a, a two, well, it's a two-mile track, and those guys get the speeds up to about 200 miles an hour. Absolutely, I mean, once you get there, you're you're hooked. You're hooked because if you can see the maneuvering of the different cars, and they're all going left, you know, but the maneuvering and the pits and whatnot, uh, putting putting on tires, all that goes towards the championship if you're lucky. If you got the right team, you'll be in that winter circle at the end of the 200 mile run. That's in Fontana. This year, uh, we'll be there also, but this year they're having uh, the last of that particular track in Fontana. They're gonna cut it down to about a mile and a half. Yeah, so they got some, some uh, not issues, but they got some track uh, figuring out on uh, what to do with the stands or whatnot, but I'm quite sure with NASCAR, the engineers get involved in it, they're gonna make a hell of a run with it. We can't wait to be there. So in about three weeks, we will be there for the last taping of the two mile track in Fontana. We're gonna bring it to you. You can't bring it to you live because Fox has it all locked up, but we'll bring it to you on Gotcha Racing TV, Gotcha Racing Live, okay? So with, with further ado, let me give you a snippet of what the award ceremony was all about. Stay tuned, here we go. One, two, three, go. Underrepresented population that has competed in racing while encouraging awareness of diversity, equity, and inclusion efforts in motorsports. Here to present the Young Racer Award, NASCAR Senior Vice President and Chief Operating or Chief Marketing Officer, Pete Jump. Driver development team. We're excited to watch him this upcoming season. 
Please join me in congratulating the 2023 Young Racer Award winner, Nathan Lyon. Congratulations on everything and looking forward to seeing how your career progresses. 